Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll show you how to do a simple oil change on the Chevrolet Cruze or any GM Ecotec 1.8 liter engine. Okay, so the first step is we're gonna jack up the car and we're gonna have an oil bucket ready. And then we're gonna go ahead and take off the drain plug. It's a 13 millimeter bolt. This isn't the original drain plug that uh, came with the car. The original drain plug that comes with the uh, 1.8 Ecotech engine is actually a 10 millimeter. So here's a small tip to avoid getting your hands dirty. So once the bolt is on its last thread, just use a magnet to take it out so like that you won't get oil on your hands. So while the oil is draining, we're just gonna clean up the uh, drain plug and push back the rubber uh, gasket. So now that all the oil has drained, put back the uh, drain plug and uh, tighten it to spec. The torque spec is on the oil pan, but you could just go uh, hand tight for that and it should be fine. Okay, and after that, we're just gonna shoot it with some brake cleaner. So now that we're done under the car, we're gonna go on top and use a 24 millimeter socket with a uh, extension to uh, loosen up the uh, oil filter housing. So to get to the oil filter, it's right by the exhaust manifold. Okay, so first you want to take off the old oil filter. Then we're going to use a small pick to take off the O-ring. Then just use some brake cleaner to clean away all the old oil. Okay, so I'm replacing it with a Fram oil filter. And now we're just gonna put on the new O-ring. Okay, so now make sure it sits at the bottom all the way around. And then take your new oil filter and where it has the four tabs sticking out, this goes towards the bottom and it should just click on. Now we're gonna put it back on the car and we're just gonna go uh, hand tight for this one too. Okay, so now that you're done, just uh, use some brake cleaner to clean off all the uh, oil that was spilled. Okay, so now we're going to put new oil. Go ahead and take off your oil filler cap. And sometimes if they don't want to come off, uh, here's the trick. You can use a rag and then uh, use some uh, pliers to twist it off. It should give you uh, a bit more torque. Okay, so now fill it up with uh, 4.5 liters of 5W30. Okay, now that we're done, we're gonna go ahead and reset the oil light. So first you wanna press menu until it brings you to the uh, vehicle information.
And after that you want to scroll to the second one and then press set clear to reset it. And that button is found here. And after that scroll upwards and press yes with the same button which is the set clear. And that's it you're done. So you could go ahead and start your engine. Uh, let it warm up and after that you could always check the dipstick to make sure you have uh, enough oil so uh, thank you guys for watching if you like this video uh, leave a thumbs up comment if you have any questions or suggestions and uh, subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys next time thanks